The pinnacle of the BMW brand, the 7 Series, will soon be available without an internal combustion engine for the very first time, and it's called the BMW i7 X Drive 60. BMW's all-new 7 Series will also be available in the standard combustion form, and as a plug-in hybrid, for those not quite sure if they are ready for a pure EV but think they want to move on from ICE. The new 7 utilizes BMW's flexible cluster architecture, CLAR, platform, which allows the i7 to be produced on the same manufacturing line as its ICE and PHEV brothers. Therefore the i7 doesn't have a bespoke chassis, as is the case for the BMW X. It also doesn't have a front storage compartment or frunk. The BMW representatives at the first look event held last week at the NY Auto Show explained that was because the i7 is built alongside the ICE and PHEV 7 series and the components up front don't allow for a storage area. But what about that huge space where the ICE normally would be? We couldn't get a concise answer to that question. It's clear by now that BMW doesn't place much importance on their EVs having a front storage area because the i4, the X and now the i7 doesn't have one. The motors are of the electrically excited synchronous variety, not fixed permanent magnet, and are produced without the need for any rare earth metals. If you're not impressed with the performance, our friends over at EV Globe tell us that BMW has a 600 plus HP version in the works that will wear an M badge and be called either i7M60 or i7M70. Battery and charging I asked a BMW representative if the company was using the same battery cells used in the X or the low height cells utilized in the i4 and was told they are using the iX's taller battery cells and using a modified version of the BMW iX's battery pack for the i7. From its internal testing, BMW estimates that the i7 will have an EPA-rated driving range of 300 miles which is slightly less than the iX's 324 miles, with the 20 inches wheels. The i7 can accept up to 11 kilowatts from a 48 amp level 2 charging station, which should completely replenish a fully depleted battery in about 10. 5 hours. As for DC fast charging, the i7 has the same 195 kilowatts peak charging rate as the X. Because of that, plus the fact that the battery is slightly smaller, the i7 should charge faster than the X, even though they have the same maximum DC fast charging rate. The i7 also comes with three years of unlimited, complementary use of the Electrify America network. That's a better deal than what BMW offers for the i4 and the X. Those vehicles come with two years of 30-minute complimentary charging sessions on the Electrify America network. I guess 7 Series customers have come to expect being treated a little better than everyone else. Spacious, luxurious cabin the i7's interior is all that you'd expect from the brand's Apex model, and then some, providing its occupants with comfort, luxury and the best of BMW's latest technology. The panoramic Sky Lounge LED roof is standard on all versions of the new 7 series and is equipped with an electronically operated sliding shade. Thanks for watching. Credits to InsideEVS.com. Please like my video and subscribe EVpedia for more electronic vehicle news and updates.